Happening now, we could get a better idea just how far behind this year's Sierra snowpack levels are. This is video from last year. Of course, February especially dry in the Bay Area. And Kara, I know you've been following this closely. So, so what are we dealing with here? Yeah, we are waiting to see the moisture content as well as how deep the snow is there at Phillips Station. We'll talk about that in just a second. Let's get to our beautiful beach weather that we've seen to start out March. And a lot of people are heading out there. Even though it's cool, we do have the sunshine and a breezy wind. And as we head inland, our temperature right now at 63 degrees in Walnut Creek. As we go through the forecast for today, we're going to see some low 70s across much of the inland areas and reaching 70. 71 degrees in Napa, 70 in San Jose, 60 will be the high in San Francisco, and 69 today in Santa Rosa. So we're seeing changes in our weather pattern. It's been so dry, but at least we will open up the door for some rain and some Sierra snow to come our way as we go into the weekend. So as we look at this approaching system coming in on Friday into Saturday, it looks like we could see some scattered showers, and then another one will be right behind that. Hopefully we'll continue to see these systems just rolling in after that point because it looks like even with those two storms passing the rainfall totals will not be that high. Some of the coastal areas will be at about four tenths of an inch and maybe about a tenth to quarter of an inch for the inland areas. But that's a live look at North Star around Lake Tahoe. It is so nice to see some snow on the ground. People out enjoying that of course is important for our recreational activities but we need it before the water storage for our reservoirs as the spring melt happens. We start to see a lot of that Sierra snow draining down into our reservoirs and we don't have that much snow up there. We're seeing overall about a 61% of our statewide average compared to normal and we're doing the worst in the southern Sierra where there is 45% of the normal amount of snow. But it is good that we do have some weather headed our way as we go deeper into the month of March. We'll be watching out for that. In the near term, it is still dry and we are also experiencing some slightly warmer than normal temperatures with our inland areas reaching into the upper 60s and low 70s through the end of the week. Check out the changes for the weekend. Only reaching the upper 50s on Saturday, so I'm thinking it might be a good weekend to stay inside just a little bit more. Uh, at least we will have some sunshine on Sunday and then some more scattered showers in the forecast on Monday. Mark